Well, new details of a potential terror attack in Maryland stopped cold by the FBI. Alex Dimitrik reports on the steps taken to contain the alleged suspect's plans to commit murder. In the blizzard of chatter on social media, a 24-year-old Bangladeshi man living in Hyattsville named Nilash Mohammad Das caught the FBI's attention with tweets like this, envying ISIS members who reached Shahada, or heaven, for murdering kuffars, or infidels. Then came something specific. He had tweeted uh, information indicating he wanted to kill a member of the U.S. military. According to court documents, September 2015, Das began tweeting support for ISIS. In May, the FBI arranged for Das to meet an undercover source. September 28th, the source provided guns and Das bought ammunition. September 30th, the two men drove to the target's home and Das was arrested by the FBI. They made certain that the weapons that they gave him were not actually going to fire. Uh, and that there wasn't uh, a real U.S. military person who was in position to be killed. The FBI follows ISIS propaganda and the recruits it raises on social media, especially when the orders call for... Make your battleground where you are. And that's really the biggest challenge that we have to face here in the U.S. Social media posts may have alerted the FBI to the suspect, but it was human intelligence that built the case. It takes that uh, supplemental human intelligence work to understand when a suspic uh, suspicious person actually turns into somebody who could pose a realistic threat. It's not a situation where the FBI gave him the idea. Alex Demetri, WJZ Eyewitness News. DAS is set to appear in federal court in Prince George's County on Thursday.